Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Adija. Thank you so much for joining me again today on the Millennial Social Worker channel. On this channel, I share content about social work, mental health, wellness, lifestyle, and everything in between because the millennial social worker is multifaceted. <laughs> Social work is a growing field, and today I'll be talking to you about some of the fastest growing social work jobs. But before I get into that, I want to draw your attention to one of my prior videos where I shared with you how I spend my lunch break. I took you down to Midtown Detroit, where I went to one of my favorite restaurants to get tacos. After you watch this video, head on over to that video to check it out, okay? I think you'll like it. Anyways, let's get back into the business of today. Social work is a growing field, and today I'll be talking to you about some of the fastest growing social work jobs. In a previous video, I shared with you that the career outlook for the social work profession is looking good. And I've also talked about how it's been reported that the overall employment for social workers is projected to grow 13% within a 10 year span. So that's 2019 to 2029. And this is much faster than the average percentage for all occupations. So this is a good thing for future social workers. You should note that the employment growth will vary depending on the specialization. So some specializations may grow more than other specializations. So here are some of the fastest growing social work jobs. <music> The first one is the child and family or school social workers. The child and family social workers will be needed to advocate for children and families. Some of the basic work that they do is to help to strengthen, you know, parenting skills, is to prevent child abuse and neglect, is to identify alternative living arrangements for children that are not able to live with their biological families for one reason or the other. In the school settings, more social workers will be needed as students' enrollments rise and also as students are returning back to school. Many students have been home for more than a year, so social workers will be needed to help students reacclimate into the school setting. In the past year alone, I've received so many emails, so many phone calls from recruiters seeking school social workers. So this is something that I can attest to that this particular field is fast growing. Some of the job titles to look out for in this particular uh, social work specialty is a uh, school social worker is a job title, adoption social worker, pediatric medical social worker, youth center social worker, you have the high school guidance counselor, to name a few. Next is the medical or healthcare social workers. I have a few videos on this channel about the different types of medical social work jobs. So please be sure, I'll link it somewhere in this video. Please be sure to check it out. Generally, you know, medical social workers, they help people of all ages to adjust to treatment recommendations, to adjust to taking medications for the first time, or just to adjust to living a healthier lifestyle. Some of the job titles uh, for medical social workers include, but not limited to, home health care social worker, hospice social worker, hospital discharge planner, outpatient medical social worker, dialysis social worker, emergency room social worker, oncology social worker. So those are some of the job titles to look out for. You should also keep in mind that some social work jobs do not have social work in their job title. It will take a little bit of research to look through those jobs to see whether or not they match the social work profession. But just something to keep in mind is that some social work jobs do not have social work in their job titles. <music> Lastly, the social work field that is expected to grow the most is the mental health and substance abuse social workers. Employment in this field will grow as more people seek treatment for mental illness, and substance abuse. Again, as somebody who is in this field in particular, I have seen how there's been so much funding towards mental health and substance abuse treatment. That shows that, you know, our government is caring about mental health, people are demanding mental health treatment, and we have, you know, people in uh, politics that are advocating for mental health. So this is a good thing because mental health treatment or funding for mental health hasn't been prioritized. As mental health is gaining more attention, mental health treatment 
is becoming normalized. Therefore, more and more people are feeling more comfortable with seeking help. In addition to that, drug offenders are increasingly being sent to treatment programs, which are staffed by social workers rather than being sent to jail. And that's a good thing as well because it focuses on rehabilitation rather than punishment. Some of the job titles for mental health and substance abuse social workers include therapist, psychiatric social worker, addiction or rehab social worker, program manager, social service director, behavioral health clinician, behavioral health consultant. The list goes on and on and on. In summary, the three fastest social work jobs are child and family or school social worker, the healthcare or medical social worker, the mental health and substance abuse social worker. So that is about it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video or you find this video helpful, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Thank you so much again for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe and share this video if you care. If you learned something new, please be sure to comment below. I would love to hear from you. You can also follow me on Instagram at millennial underscore social worker to keep up with me. I love engaging with you all. Again, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time on my next video. God bless you and take care. Bye.